I'm about to pick up quite literally my biggest estate sale purchase ever. Look at all the hats I got here, you know. So we're doing 160, 150? <laughs> this is great news, y'all. Y'all saw me wheeling. A bunch of crates, bags. That's because finally I sorted through all my vintage blanks that I've been curating. Around like 150. And right now, I'm about to drop it off at this print shop. It was honestly like 45 minutes away just because freaking traffic, dude. But yeah, we're gonna drop it off to get printed on. That means we were that much closer to releasing the website, y'all. I'm super excited with this print. And so hopefully it turns out great. Hopefully it looks good on the blanks. And hopefully y'all enjoy it as well. We actually have a bunch more right here from my bedroom that I didn't organize. Remember y'all in the last video I overdyed some uh, thermal blanks. We got some right here, we got some other blanks as well. A couple of personals for myself, but around 150 pieces total. Always gotta be content, you know? Top of literally the freaking morning, y'all. Got the coffee in hand, and we got the eggs boiling for breakfast. All right, y'all, we are here at the sale. Let me go ahead and start eating my eggs, bro. Put some Dano seasoning on there. Doesn't look that appetizing. Definitely doesn't smell good, I'll tell you that much. Oh my gosh, that's perfect egg. I can do it. Stop focusing on me. That's perfect for a freaking hard boiled egg. Anyways, y'all, this property is absolutely beautiful. Tucked away. Looks like there's gonna be a bunch of random old stuff in there, which I'm hopeful for. But what I'm actually here for is not even really the clothes because I didn't even post really that much clothes. But I'm looking for this white couch because, and I'll expand on it later on in a different video, but finally moving out the mom's house, which is perfect because I'm about to get married in literally like 40 days. And so I had to get the spot already, get that out of the way. And now I just got to finalize like honeymoon stuff. But yeah, life is getting real, y'all. And so, couch is obviously something we're gonna need. And Facebook Marketplace, they have good stuff, but sometimes they be taxing. And I'm like, you know what? I pull up to stay sales anyways. There's always, <laughs> I'm just holding an egg. There's always good furniture there, good vintage furniture. I was like, you know what? Why not? Honestly, I did not think I'd be ever purchasing white leather couches, but but the flooring in our apartment is like super light orangey tint wood. And so I think my fiance made a good point that like, I don't know, like regular brown leather might not look good in it. And I was like, I kind of have a point. I do like brown leather though. And maybe this is just for the season and we'll sell these couches and then get different ones. But you know, it is not an estate sale if I'm not looking for clothes. So we got two Chargers crew necks. These will go easily. Nice little yellow back, boom. These will go easily in uh, San Diego just because obviously everyone loves the Chargers. Come on. All right, this is not gonna work. How much you guys think I spent on those couches together? Closest guess, I'll give you Venmo, five bucks. Comment down below how much those set of couches were, five bucks. In reality, y'all, we only wanted one of those couches, the big one for the living room. And the vision for it is honestly like dress up the white couch and color it up with like colored rug and other accent chairs that are colored and then pillows on the white couch that make it pop. Appreciate it. Why am I talking like they can hear me? <laughs> Who else does that when they're driving? Like, hey, thank you. Appreciate it. Like, bro, what are you doing? Um, bro just stays talking to himself. <laughs> but yeah, maybe try and sell that smaller couch. If not, honestly, I think for the price that I paid for both, I can charge for that smaller one. Huh. Worst case scenario, use it for the office space and it'll be a win-win. All right, all right, all right. Made another pit stop to a state sale. I was literally about to go to the gym, but I was like, you know what? Why not? Why not? I drove another 30, 35 minutes, grabbed some goodies. I was surprised actually that there was some good stuff left because I was literally 
The sale started at nine, I got here at like 10.30. But uh, first of all, y'all see the hat. Got some pins, boom, 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 boom. And we got some other hats as well. A Marlboro racing team, boom. Needs a little reshape, nice red corduroy. Corduroy hats are like just sick, honestly. Ski bear, a little brown corduroy. Shout out to the Padres. Hopefully they do better this year, bro. I don't know what's going on with them. This one's sick, I don't even know what it's kind of cap is called a little camel joint this is sick does it fit me hey it does not fit my big old head <laughs> random hat but i like the color and the fade on it and then we got a little random sweater boom this one's for me for uh, my little gym grind older nike uh shorts booty shorts and then of course y'all it's spring it's summer booty shorts are coming got a few of these older amber combi and fitch tees boom this one's cool Little two-tone joint, older Hong Kong tag. Can you all see it? Ah, uh, boom. Random beer shirt, cool graphic. This one's dope. Stress, it's like a little definition shirt. This one's stained up too, but cool graphic. I hate blood bank shirts, but this one's actually legit. San Diego blood bank. It's got like everything that's cool with San Diego. Bunzai bungee. Back graphic right here. Little guy bungee jumping. That's one thing I'll never do, y'all. Like. I don't think I could ever bungee jump. These two striped Amber Combi and Fitch shirts. And then this one's called a little Jurassic Park I Will Survive T. You guys know that hype around Trader Joe's merch? This one's actually vintage Trader Joe's. Look at this. Vintage Trader Joe's tag. Boom. Y'all see that? Ah, little front hit. And then back hit. There's two little slits in the back, but whatever, so cool, it's not that big of a deal. That's crazy, I didn't even know Trader Joe's was around that long, but I gotta get home and eat, bro. I have not eaten, and we still gotta go to the gym, because y'all know, if we go to the sales and skip the gym, we still gotta hit it. This is what I call multitasking at its finest. Y'all hear the sizzle, right? And <laughs> right here, we about to put some oxy in some white shirts. A little bit of oxy in there. Check on our beef. Two kinds of cooking, y'all. This one and then another one. Obviously showed y'all this morning's pickups at the sale, but we're gonna go through the rest of this week's. And if this is boring content for y'all, let me know. I don't wanna be redundant with just always showing pickups. I wanna make sure y'all are entertained. Yeah, I just wanted to show y'all the behind the scenes of this job. Like, this is the tedious, annoying parts that not everyone really gets to see. This is the sorting through, and right now for my case, like organizing which one goes to the site, or which one I wanna save for the site, and which one will go to the markets, because I sell tomorrow and Saturday. So, hey, let me show y'all some of the pieces. No, oh, what is that, Mickey? Um, all this random inventory, bruh. As far as t-shirts go, this is probably the best thing I found this week. It's this vintage Eagles Banty on the giant tag. I got this at a random, literally random estate sale yesterday. Pulled up, there were just a few shirts. This was one of them. It was like in an office building kind of estate sale. I'm like, what kind of sale is this? But I mean, this was there. Nice blanket lined Lee jacket. Boom, this one's actually really beautiful with some patches on both sleeves. Boom, patched up. Boom, patched up. Nice wash, nice fade, nice wear. And then now that we're kind of going into spring, I got a couple of these. Mm. I don't know where the other one went because of the mess of these clothes here. Um, but these kind of like OG 107 shorts is like actually super dope. I might keep one pair for myself, one pair on the site. It's got a whole lot of holes, but boom. I don't know if you guys can see that. Boom, it's got all of California, Oakland, Long Beach, San Francisco. It's like a whole map of California. Where's San Diego at? Oh, there it is. Boom, shout out San Diego, baby. Oh, this nice black little dragon shirt. I got uh, another Chargers crew neck joint. This one's nice little puff print. Okay. Oh, look, I'm definitely saving this for my future kid. Bell bottom cheetah print. That's crazy. Yeah, literally, uh, the bins were uh, basura. I mean, I wouldn't say that. Just like some good mids, good fillers. These kind of things sell really well in San Diego. Oh, this one's actually kind of random. I'm like a 90s Lee hoodie. Salvation Army, it says in the sleeve right there. Or not sleeve, but on the left pocket. Salvation Army. Camp Ponderosa Ranch. I don't know. Random as heck. I'm telling y'all, I got kids too. If y'all got kids, I got kids clothes too. This one's super dope polo. Leather jackets here in San Diego. I don't know why, but they do pretty solid. Like at least L1 per event. Shout out Earth Day. Boom. 80s black souvenir jacket. Super sick. I still 
still needing to get like the 50s, 40s one, let's say Japan, or I honestly need a Philippines one. That's really what I need. If you got one that's not taxed to the max, let me know. But if you're taxed and I get it, get your money. Just gotta get that back shoulder fixed. But this one's cool. This one's dope. But yeah, time to freaking put these in. Hangers, God, that's heavy. <laughs> another morning, another day, another sale. I'm out here in shorts. I'm literally freezing my legs. I don't know why. I didn't think it would be that freaking cold. I had my coffee, of course. Um, had the sale. Four other people in front of me looking like they're grabbing the same thing. Mm, dang it. But, you know, you never know if you never go, baby. Honestly, it just takes one person to go to the wrong room for someone else to cook. And so, we'll see. It's all love. Subscribers here too digging. Oh yeah. He took everything from me, bro. This no, guy. No, what kind of what kind of subscriber is this? <laughs> I just cooked you though, dude. Look. Yeah, you, you did, bro. I got no clothes on the Cooked them. <laughs> Look at all the hats we got here, y'all. It's a little bit crazy. It's my pile. So we were at two of these, but if I take these out. Honestly, bro, if you want to keep those in, um would you do 175 for all of it? Yeah, I'll do that. Yeah? I'll do that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm about to show y'all how nice meal prep Miggy is with it. But first, I just gotta get some uh, pepper and crushed red pepper. I like the ones with the grinder. <laughs> this one has like a good amount, so we'll do this guy. What hell is this seven bucks? <laughs> some H. All right, now that we got it, y'all, this is how we're gonna marinate it. A little black pepper, olive oil, soy sauce, and then sesame oil, red pepper, some fresh garlic. Now we're gonna cook it up in the air fryer for a little air crisp. 390 for 20. I, 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 we got a lot of hats. Broom, cruising, Chevrolet, boom, official bikini inspector. Metro Milwaukee auto auction. Miller High Life, Milwaukee, boom. This one's cool. Pennzoil Racing, boom. Got a little uh, tassel right here too, I don't know what for, but we got another highlighter joint, the Heartbeat of America, boom. This one's sick. WWF Wrestling. All right, this one's probably one of my favorites that I got. This Princeton University joint, corduroy. If y'all know me, orange, I love it. So anything orange gets my attention. Another highlighter joint, Indianapolis 500. This one's cool, the Auburn joint, boom. The bill, side hits, side hits, front hit, crazy. This one's a cool little camo. Magnum PI, Hawaii. Another Hawaii joint, boom cord. Another. In Another Indianapolis joint, boom. Oxford University, boom. This one's cool, corduroy. Pro Select Racing, boom. Another indie hat right there. Disney MGM Studios, yellow corduroy. This one's cool, I love the colors on this. Beige and orange. It's got that puffy print too in the front. And then our last set of them, another trucker joint. This one's got a little piggy in the front. Oh, this one's cool. Miami Hurricanes, boom. Another camo joint, boom. Charlotte Hornet snap. This one is super dope. Ohio State, corduroy, boom. Super clean, like a lot of these hats this dude did not wear. This one's cool. Royal Blue joint, boom. Mobile racing. This one's for the BMW lovers, 328i. BMW hit in the back, ah, focus, boom. And then lastly, we got this Harvard script joint, beautiful. And as far as clothes, y'all, nothing really too highlight worthy. Besides this, 90s reverse weave champion, boom. Here we are, y'all. Got the cilantro, lime, rice, the salmon, pickled onions. Golly. Yeah, I just want to get on the same page. All right, guys. I haven't seen this guy in a while in the vlog, but um, he said he had a few pieces for the boy. Let's see if we can lowball him. <laughs> All right. Show us what we got first. That one I'm kind of, mm, mm, mm. I like the two shirts though, for sure. This is Miggy color for sure. This this one. I don't know if mm -hmm. you this one. I wouldn't wear this one. I'd probably sell this one. Nah. What's for the four? I was asking 175. Okay. But I love you and your wedding soon, so I'll do 100. <gasps> uh, I'll do 30 on this one. And then this one's 35. And then I was gonna ask 50, but I'll do 40. So what are we at? Yeah. All right, like two? One. I'll pass on the weave. Would you do 150 together for these? 
It was at 165. I'll do 165. I think I'm 75, my boy. Bob boy, but this and one's and Percy. Two are Percy. I'm only making money on one of them. <laughs> Those two are personal. This one, this is the only one I'll be selling. Let's do 160. Or coin flip, 150, 160. The first time you cooked me, second time I cooked you. I know. So we're doing 160, 150? Yeah. Okay, let it drop or catch it flip. I like no. the catch flip. Uh, you like the drop whatever it? You, whatever you think more okay. entertaining. You call it. Okay. What up? <laughs> All right. No, you call it. Okay. Tails. Wait up. Can they see it? Can they see it? <laughs> Wait, we're supposed to let it drop. It's head. Literally from raining to yesterday's event to now being freaking burned. Oh my gosh, you guys see that? I just get dark ASAP. That one I was doing 40 on the charter side. This one out the room for 20. Okay, and how much yeah. are these kids? Uh, that one I was doing 15. Cool, yeah. I'll take them. Yeah, you wanna get this one too? Cool? Yeah, 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 it's perfect. Cool, bro. Thank awesome. you, man. Yeah, appreciate Have it. a great weekend. Hey, can you hold it real quick? Anytime I see it. This guy's the, what is it? I Swear. Hold it. No, I'm being dead ass. I'm being dead ass, bro. Alright. Hey, yo, <laughs> why are you drinking on the job? Yeah! <laughs> Hey. <laughs> what is wrong with bro? <laughs> and you can use my neighbors right over here. You just throw it on. Hey, my dog? Yeah, yeah, of course, dude. Kai, where are you sit? Can you sit? What's your dog's name? Kai. Kai, how you doing, Kai? Sit. Guys, I'm kind of hungry. <laughs> I'm just kidding. This guy. Every time you know when I say, if you leave no, this specific no. comment, you get already. five bucks on Venmo. This guy gets it every time, y'all. And I'm sorry. Let him know what you do. I, uh, expose yourself. You gotta uh, skip to the end, see when he's like this, and then you're like, <laughs> oh no, it's definitely a $5 giveaway. Yo, so, so you don't watch the video? I go back, and then I watch the video. Alright, alright, there you go, you saved yourself. Oh wow, Miggy's a little dressed up today, huh? Well yeah, I am on my way to church, but first y'all, I'm about to pick up quite literally my biggest estate sale purchase ever. Oh, there, we go. there we go. Well my back hurts and uh, we could only fit one in, so gotta come back tomorrow, but quite literally the biggest estate sale purchase I've ever made. It's in y'all, big boy couch is in. Shout out to the boys. Yup, yup, my macolets, y'all. Yeah. They didn't give us uh, utensils. We had to literally eat pho with straight yeah. bare hands, y'all. Look how messy it is. Who let me be in my own place by myself? <laughs> uh, this is not a good start, y'all. This is not a good start. My boy EJ, oh, I picked it up, but we had a chicken wing and there was a piece of chicken skin down over here. The recoil from here to here is crazy. <laughs> Bro was hungry. Bro had to go like this <laughs> for it to flip down here. Why did you walk in the room, girl? You're making it harder to function. Step on the scene, you're looking at me, and my heart started jumping. And they'll never get it, cause baby, they think it's just casual loving.